Welcome back to Bowler Central. It's your boy E loading. Uh, we also got your boy Phil, and we got John P. Meyer on the bottom. We are here today, ready to do a Madden. Who we think deserves the Madden cover by team? So, uh, just to let you guys know, you can find us on Instagram, Twitter, Twitch, TikTok, YouTube, Spotify, Spotify Visuals, also as well, Only and fans. Apple Podcasts. You can find us on OnlyFans as well. You feel me? Um. But let's get to it. You know, we're gonna go by each all thirty-two teams. We're gonna go all thirty-two teams, and then we're gonna see who would we give the cover to. And we're not gonna decide on one cover. We're all just gonna give our opinion on who gets the cover, why they get the cover. Maybe a little argument, but we're gonna move on. Okay. And we are going to start with we got we want to go Arizona first. Cardinals first stop. Shoot, might as well Arizona. just start with the Cardinals. <laughs> We go in uh, order, like alphabetical <laughs> order. You know I mean? um, sure. So the Arizona Cardinals. I don't know if you're gonna big up the the logo or anything. No, that's the best I could do to be honest. All right, <laughs> that's say fine. that because I was I was hoping you didn't do that. Start okay, with the okay. Arizona Cardinals. We're gonna go in order of alphabetical order backwards. So Phil, John, me. Okay. Oh, uh, honestly, they, there's no other choice. It has to be Kyler Murray. Uh, that yeah. DeAndre Hopkins is gone. There's no other yeah. talent. Cliff Kingsbury's gone. He's a Thailand, so oh, no, he's back from Thailand. But yeah, there's no other choice. I'm gonna, have to, I'm yeah. gonna have to disagree. Okay, what you got, John? I got Buddha Baker. Put that man uh, on the cover. Put that yeah, man on the cover. Yeah. Buddha Baker. Give me names like that, boys. Not, yeah, I, I, I forgot about Buddha. Okay. I mean, but Kyler would be the top one. I forgot to say this in the intro. Um, we about to set up a GoFundMe to get John a new mic because this shit has been fucking up oh, all night. No. John, I, I, I'll show you the I'll show you the replay of it. Only when right. I get excited. Um, that, that is true. I'm not gonna lie to you. Go ahead. Yeah. Um. My 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 answer for the Arizona Cardinals will also be Kyler Murray. Um. I do like Buddha Baker. If he didn't get run down by DK Metcalf, I put him on the cover. All right. But it's right. definitely Kyler. Um. Okay. Next up is the Atlanta Falcons. I think we all have the same answer here. Uh, ooh. Wow. Ooh, oh, wow. Do you want to go? Kyle go Pitts. Ahead. I feel like uh, I know we don't. I know we feel a certain way about having rookies on there, but I feel like Bajan Robinson is one of those rookies I wouldn't mind having be on the cover. I'm I agree. It. I like. Okay. He, he, he's been done electric. His name has been going up throughout the whole offseason and draft. I, I I know it's probably Kyle Pitts or Cordell or Drake London, but I I wouldn't be mad at Bajan Robinson having the cover here. I also okay, like uh, okay. Young Hung Ko. Young Way. Young Way Ko. My Young bad. Way. Young Way Ko. I think I think he's an amazing player to put on. If you're going to put on a kicker, that's he's, he should be he's the top three kicker. You put him on uh, that cover. He didn't leave the Falcons at points two years ago. Yeah, so. But right, Bijan would probably be my top. All right. Um, I was actually going to say Drake London. I thought everybody had a understanding okay. that he was probably the best player on the Falcons last year. He was. Yeah. Um. I would have been fine if somebody else would have said uh, Kyle Pitts as well, but I thought Drake London was going to be the answer. But hey, or, or, I'm not... or their corner. I like Drake London, but Who's or corner? AJ Terrell. Okay, AJ, AJ Terrell. Terrell. AJ Terrell okay. would be cool. But I thought I, I thought Drake London was going to be the answer there. Um, but hey, I'm not mad at you guys. Um, next up, we got the Baltimore Ravens. I think we all agree. <laughs> it's got to be. It's, it's got to be. One it's guy. Lamar. Okay. Oh no, back up. Oh. Well, Phil's trolling, guys. Phil, it's stop trolling o- OBJ like that. Hey, what? yo, what the fuck? It's definitely Lamar. Sorry. Zay Flowers? No. Yeah. That's cool. uh, Justin Antonio Tucker? Brown? Justin Tucker. Antonio Justin Brown? Tucker. Nah, that, that, he was lying. It was, it was, I yeah, know, it, it was but joking. still. All right, so we moving on. It was Lamar. And John Bills, Harbaugh, no. The Bills, everybody's going to say Josh. Right? Actually, I'm not. Okay. Go ahead, Phil. Uh, for me... Uh, yeah, Josh Allen. Like he, he's been the cover boy for the Bills for a while. He's one of the top quarterbacks in the league. He's rumored to be this year's Madden cover athlete. Why not? Why not him? He's close to MVP award, so he's been close to multiple times. So he's yep. probably the best player on this team. So John, I like I I like Josh Allen. I think he should be on the cover, but I think you got to put Diggs on the cover with him. Mm. Their connection, amazing. I'd put Diggs over him personally. Just with some of the catches he'd be making, but Elijah will buy that cover so fast. Okay. I know that's what I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> looking to advertise it. Or he, he buy a disc. I don't know how long the last time he bought a disc, Elijah, but he would buy a disc immediately. Um, I'm gonna be honest right now. Um, because I was just arguing about being unbiased before the podcast, I am gonna put Josh <laughs> Allen on this cover. He should be on the cover this year, I think. I believe, but um, 
if Diggs is on the cover, hey, I'm, Mike Phil said I'm buying. I'm buying the poster. I'm buying the poster. <laughs> nice. I'm buying the disc edition. I'm buying the digital edition. <laughs> I'm buying everything that has to do with this cover. Diggs is the goat. Um. Next up, we got the Carolina Panthers. Skip. No. Yeah. No. Um, <laughs> Ooh, CJ? CJ is really the only answer here. Oh, uh, who else is a Panther? Miles oh. Sanders. No. Adam Wait, isn't Steelers. CJ on the Houston Texans? No, that's Bryce. Bryce. Oh, Bryce oh that's Bryce. My bad. My bad. My bad. Yeah, CJ. Or oh, maybe uh, the quarterback. Who's their corner? I forgot. Who. I know who you're talking about, too. JC uh, Horn. JC Horn. JC Horn or uh, CJ Shrug? No, you guys are wrong. Bryce Young is on the Carolina Panthers. Okay, so it's Bryce. Okay, I got it. Oh, so CJ shows on the Texans. Yes. Okay. So Bryce, I'm like, oh bad. Yeah. Yeah, Bryce Young. Bryce Young goes on the cover. Then, any any way you any way you any way you slice it, Bryce Young goes on the cover. I don't even think. I think I actually like Bryce Young as a player over CJ. I'm glad he ended up in Carolina, and um, he'll do great things. Yeah. Who you got? Oh, Sam Bryce Young. Gotcha. Everybody. Chicago. Chicago. The Chicago. The Chicago Bears. Everybody is going to have the same answer here. Right, DJ Moore. No, uh, Phil is trolling. Phil's a bad troll. Um, Justin Fields. Uh, yes, from my, from my pick, obviously. Yeah. Okay. Electric. John. John. It would be I'll, Justin I'll, Fields. I'll, yeah. But okay, I, Justin Fields. But I would I would make it so it'd be like the eighty five Bears, as in like it'd be like a. Like they're kind of their team with their personalities, but different players on the Chicago Bears, like Clear Clay Cool. I know you don't like it, but I mean, I think they got weapons. I think the Bears are going to do well things this year now that Aaron Rodgers is gone. So, I mean, maybe you don't like that, but I'm going to go. The Lions are still in that division. I get that. I and I'm a Lions fan. I'm I'm going to probably root for the Lions more than the Bears, but I think, I think Wilson's going to do some things. You know what I mean? <laughs> okay. Gonna, gonna um. Do so I got Justin Fields. Justin Fields on the do cover. Some Now the Bengals. This could be two oh, options. Yeah, sorry. This could be the Bengals. True options. Uh, I'm, I'm good, Jamar. You know, one of the most electrifying wide receivers in the league. The they, they popularized the gritty him and Justin Jefferson alone, and I'm pretty sure they capitalize on that in next year's Madden as well. So yeah, Justin Jefferson. I'm sorry, Jamar Chase. I bet LSU boy. <laughs> John, it would be uh, T Higgins, uh, Joe Burrow in the middle, and Chase. Right next. What's up with you in the group? In the group covers? I like group covers, bro. They need to bring them back. There's so many group the photographers. I'm thinking, how does this look? How does this look nice? You know, they need to make it dramatic. Maybe a defensive player too. I don't know. Probably not. Yeah, though. the same one that um, messed up Antonio Brown's career. How could you? Fontes. No. Uh, I'd put T. Higgins because he took the more. I mean, I'd put. Um, <laughs> I would definitely put Joe Burrow on the cover. Yeah. yeah. I think if Josh Allen's not on the cover, it should be Joe Burrow. So sure. Right. So we moving on. Um, we got the Cleveland Browns. I think. Oh. Look, I'm I'm actually interested to see what you guys would say. Ooh. I think oh, they have. Three, I, go first? I think they have three go options. Go ahead. I'd go Amari Cooper. Okay. I think he had an amazing year last year. He, I mean, he. Everyone thought he was done with his career, and he he's been killing it. So yep. it'd be him, maybe with Watson, but yeah, him. He helped me win in fantasy last year in sleeper. Yeah. Shout out to uh, Give me Miles Garrett. The, okay. The defensive player of the year candidate, I don't know how many years in a row. One of the, the, the best player, I believe. Maybe like a top 10 player in the league, but that's debatable. But definitely one of, a great talent. I think he's 98, 99 and Madden regardless. So he, he'd be an interesting story career kind of guy where you're growing yeah. with him. Miles I'm not Garrett. mad at I'm not mad at either of those. I'm gonna go Nick Chubb actually. Yep. Really? Okay. I'd okay. put Nick Chubb on the cover. Another Browns running back. Peyton Hillis was the last one. Um yeah, I just go Nick Chubb. I, there's no explanation. I think he's RB1 next year for real. It's either gonna be him, Saquon, or CMC next year. I think those are the RB ones. But in terms of a running back, he's definitely surpassed Derrick Henry in my eyes. And um yeah. I'm going so, Chubb. For the Cowboys, this is going to be interesting. Zeke is still not signed, by the way. Zeke is still a free agent. Deservingly so. Get him out the league. He's done. <laughs> um, there are definitely a few options you can go here. There are a few options you will go Ooh, here. This is, yeah, this is a good amount, actually. I'll go first here. What? Yeah. I'm putting CD on the cover, though. Okay. CD like lands that. on the cover. Maybe catching no, I, a ball I, over somebody. I'm yeah. going gonna, I'm gonna to go uh, Tony Pollard here. Really? I am, yeah. I oh. think I think he is one of the options that you could put on this cover. 
I think he had an amazing year and he's ready to take over in Dallas. And I mean, oh. I'm going to go back to Parsons. Okay. Been, That's a great pick too. He, you know, he's been a, a star player the last two years. He's going to continue being that star player. And why not? It's one of the most popular players in the league as well. I mentioned not, him yesterday. Yeah. Not mad at that at all. Um, we have the Denver Broncos now, which Tim Tebow legacy cover. We need that shit. Tim Tebow time, fourth quarter time. We no. need that shit. Michelle, you're one of the reasons Tim Tebow is a top time selling jersey. I just want to let you know that. You know Thank who's you. the top ten selling jersey? It, 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 Christmas like gift, eight. birthday gift. I I need a Florida Gators or a Tim Tebow Broncos jersey. If if anyone that looks to give, give me a gift stands up, okay. Tim well, Tebow legacy cover. That's my answer. That's your answer. All right. I guess oh. I'd go. Sean, pa- I go Sean Payton. I'd put the first coach on the cover with Sean Payton. First, I didn't know we were doing legacy covers because I would have put somebody else for the Panthers. That's a whole new video. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I mean, I didn't oh, think we were doing on, legacy Phil. covers, Phil. Come pick on, a, Phil. you gotta pick a current. You gotta right. know a uh, current player or coach. I'm going Sean Payton. Uh, I guess Javante Williams. Oh, you don't want to ride? With All right, you? I'm going Pat Sertain. Okay. Oh uh, yeah, that's also a good pick. It's a good pick. I'll yeah. say Russell, but after last year, Ooh. He got Russell misses this year. window. I hope, he, I hope he steps it up. I hope he steps it up. But um, yeah, yeah it's gonna no, be. You you have an actual coach. No excuses this this year. None. Yep. All right. So we're moving over to the Detroit Lions, Detroit. and this one is real interesting. I want to see what you guys would say. Uh, mine is a little bit out the box. Jam- oh, I'm sorry. It's not. It's not. I have to wait for the other team. Sorry. Uh, I'm going Aiden Hutchinson. That's what I was gonna pick. Okay. Damn it. Y'all got Aiden Hutchinson. Well, I don't. I... I'm gonna. I got another one. I got another option. <laughs> Go ahead. Uh. I, I I like what – I think you said I'm said Brown, so I'm going to – Yeah. I like him as an option. All right. Um, To be a little different here, step outside the box, I'm going to actually just put Jared Goff on the cover. I'm a big Jared Goff fan anyway. Got, holy so, gospel. Um, He's really turned I, Tur- Detroit around too. He did, and I think McVay just wasn't the right coach for him. Mm-hmm. And that's not to say McVay isn't a good coach, but for Jared Goff, he did not need the pressure of the LA organization that they put on him. He didn't need that. He got the Detroit, and now he's just showing I could I could just ball. Feel free to ball. And shout out um, Jared Goff for doing that. Moving on, we got the Green Bay Packers, and I'm pretty Ooh. sure we all have the same answer. But I'm interested to see what you guys see first. Uh, you know, the obvious answer would be Aaron Jones. But give me A.J. Dillon. I know he had a rough year last year. But I feel like he's a very marketable player. He has a good social media following. I think if he has a good year, he could be you know, a bad cover athlete. And then down, down the road, right now, though, every time I think we different. Have, every time I think we have the same answer, we don't. John, what you got? We always got to mess it up. Now. I'm I'm hitting myself in the it's eleven o'clock and I can't remember his name uh, time. But who's who's the quarterback taking over for Aaron Rodgers? Jordan Jordan Love. Jordan Love. I I would put Jordan Love on the cover just to make it a story of. From uh, Brett Favre to Aaron Rodgers to now a new chapter begins in Jordan Love. Okay. That's um, what I would do. My cover, this is why I wouldn't work for EA. <laughs> I'm just saying, that would be a great story. <laughs> my cover is Jair Alexander. I like that a lot. Yeah, he's like the that best a lot. player on the team by far. For now, he might get traded out. I'm pretty sure he doesn't want to stay there during the ve- developmental. Absolutely. Um, Pretty sure he's in win-now mode. But, yeah, Jair Alexander is my cover. So, we're going to move on from Green Bay because that is a sad story out there. That's Sorry. a wasteland now. Hope they lose uh, a lot of games. Thank you very we're much. We're moving on to the Houston Texans, which we thought it was Bryce Young, but C.J. Stroud is their quarterback. And I'm pretty sure C.J. Stroud is all of our covers. Yep. I'm, I don't even want to waste time here. Yeah. yeah. So, we're going to move on to the Colts, which Oof. is another sad franchise. And, um, Phil, go ahead. Uh, I mean, I'll probably I'll go to the obvious answer. Justin Taylor, I'll let you okay. run it back the last two, three years. Yeah, no, no, no break. I, I wasn't sure if you would say Mike, uh, Michael Pittman Jr. or not. I was the main thing I said him so badly. All right, so I think we're all gonna sit here and actually say Jonathan Taylor. I'm, right? I'm not Anthony, I'm gonna Richardson. Say Anthony not. Richardson. I will go Anthony Richardson Florida. or or Nelson. Uh, they're really? Quentin Nelson? Line. Yeah, I think if their their offensive line needs to improve from last year, but Quentin, I don't think an offensive line has ever been on Madden, right? No. There have been there have been any linemen. Nope. Not offensive. Okay. Well, then I'd put I'd make him the first offensive lineman. I'm not mad at that actually. I was oh, that's, thinking that's I was thinking maybe the whole O line. 
Mm -hmm. have them line up against somebody, but you don't really want to have them line up against another team. With Anthony Richards, like, calling out plays, like, you could have, like, well, it'd be like a ghost kind of thing where you, like, look in picture-wise. I like that. That's Maybe. I'm not mad at that. Um, We got the Jacksonville Jaguars. I don't want to waste time here. We all got Trevor Lawrence on the cover. Trevor Lawrence. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I like Nobody Trevor Lawrence. Has, everybody has Trevor Lawrence on the cover, so oh. we're going to move on to the Kansas City Chiefs. I already know John's pick. He wants Mahomes and Kelsey. That's right. Both <laughs> of them together. They are a package deal. Give me just Kelsey. Just Mahomes Travis has, Kelsey? Mahomes has enough shine with Madden covers. Let Kelsey get one solo one, please. No, his iconic phrase, you have to fight for your right to party. That needs to be him saying it on the cover. We, we've seen Mahomes enough times. We've seen, we've seen Mahomes and Brady on the cover together. Let's just do Cal, Travis Kelsey, one of the best head ends in league history, as one cover, a solo cover. I'll say this. If Kels, if Travis is on the cover, I want Jason on the cover as well. He needs to be with him. Yeah, Jason I want Kelsey. Them, I want them together. Step brother style? But, yeah, but my answer for this one is actually Isaiah Pacheco. I like that. To I make, to make it a little it. different, I kind of want Isaiah Pacheco on the cover. Seventh round pick from Rutgers. Yep. Last so, great court running back to come out of Rutgers since Ray Rice. Rutgers. I like that. I don't I don't remember the last great player to come out of Rutgers, period. You feel me? Yeah. Ray Rice. Ray Rice came out of Rutgers. Golly. Yep. That was Sanu. so long ago. <laughs> yeah. Well, um, so who we got? On the bottom, you got Travis Kelsey alone. John got Kelsey and Mahomes. And yep. I got Isaiah Pacheco. Um, Raiders. We're moving on to the Raiders. The Raiders. Las Vegas Raiders. And um, I'll go first here. Tay, Your Sir, boy. Tay, Sir Devontae Adams. Sir. Sir Tay Adams is on this cover. What you got? Uh, I'd probably say the same. I, I don't think I could debate that. What about you, Phil? Yeah. I mean, yeah, it's hard to debate. But, I mean, if, if it had to be a back option, Josh Jacobs after last year. Sure. I think he, he, he led the league in yards or touchdowns, one of those two. But if, it, if, if, if they said no to Devontae Adams, Josh Jacobs would be a, a good number two. Yeah. I, I, I agree with Josh Jacobs being a number two. But it's really just Tay. Yeah, I agree. Uh, Chargers, I hate to say it. John's favorite, Jay Herbo. It's yeah. probably Justin Herbert. I'll be unbiased uh, and say that. I'll say Phil, Justin Herbert. Phil, what you got? Uh, yeah, J- Jay Herbo. I got to go. Okay. Either him um, or Derwin James. Yeah. It's going to be Herbert for sure. I'm a little upset that Keenan Allen missed his window for real. Oh, yeah. Sure. That would have been a good Back cover. Back in the day? Ooh. That would have been a great cover, but it's Justin Herbert for sure. Um, you didn't have the QB. You had Philip Rivers too late, unfortunately. Yeah. Um. Now we're moving on to the other LA team, the Rams, and um. Phil. Aaron Donald. I love yeah. to get some of the best players of love. We get AD number ninety nine, ninety nine, ninety nine rating, ninety nine uniform. It makes sense. I think well, Elijah said it yesterday, but I'd I'd probably <laughs> do what happened. What they would they should have done if John Madden unfortunately didn't pass, which was put all the veterans that won the Super Bowl on the cover. Yeah. You know what I mean? I think I think that'd be a great cover. Okay. Yeah, it should have been Stafford, uh, Cup, Donald, Ramsey, and you just have McVay on the bottom with the headset with Corn Cross. That would have been a great cover. And if I had to pick one person though, I'd just take Cup. Yeah. Okay. He deserves it. He really do. He did. And I think last year, you know, he got hurt. So I'm not going to take anything away from him and how amazing he is as a receiver. That whole team was hurt. Good Lord. I, yeah, I the whole think team was hurt. Back. Stafford got hurt almost immediately. Uh, yeah, they had no O line every other week. Yeah, that's facts. The Cup got hurt in like week five. Aaron Donald yeah. ended up getting hurt. Jalen Ramsey was the only one really there. He can't do it by himself. Right. Stafford got hurt after I think they were like a little under 500, maybe a game or two under 500. Right. The season was a wash. Um, but yeah, um, we moving on from the Rams. Hopefully, I'll step it up this year. We move into the Miami Dolphins, and for Miami, go ahead. I know it's cliche to uh, to to put quarterbacks on the cover, but I'd put two after the two concussions. I think that guy, he's probably one of the toughest guys I've seen in a recent minute. You know what I mean? Just you just from to- like. The speculation to like how he throws to him coming back and forth from those concussions, like I just that's I'm I'm throwing in my hat. So oh, you, the, you want him on like after the two after the two concussions? No, happen. I'm just I like, if he's still playing. I know where If he's still the quarterback, yeah, you know what I mean. Like I, you know what I mean. Like I don't. I'm not trying to like say he's gonna have another concussion. I'm just saying that like you know what I mean. I don't know. He should be rewarded for that. Yes, he got well, the past the bills already. Uh, you think so? It's a good thing we passed the Bills already. Uh, for me, 
Uh, Tyreek Hill. I mean, the, sure. the Cheetah, 99 overall as well. One of the most electric personalities in the league and has a good social following, social media following, and gamer. <laughs> Makes sense. Sure. Yeah, it's Hill and Waddle for me. I said it yesterday. That's the that's the cover if it's Miami. Sure. I'm putting both of them on there. It's not Tua. I just need him to stay healthy and um, really produce. But, um, yeah, that's that. Um, we get, Moving on to the Vikings. Everybody got Jay Jettas. We're moving on from Jay that. Jettas. I'm going to the Patriots now. And, um, Phil, this is your favorite team. I'll let you have it. There's a good amount of options here. But I think the most deserving, out of ever since he got there, Matthew Judon, I think he was top three in sacks each year. Uh, a close second would be Ramondre, but I got to go with my guy. Someone whose jersey I have yet to get, so I, I, I'll be getting him jersey very soon, but I got to go with Matthew Judon. Okay. John, what you got? This is going to be a not uh, so popular opinion, but I think he's played well enough in the, the hell that he's he's been around. I'm going to go Mac Jones. Very unpopular. I know. It's a very unpopular opinion, but I think, I think if he actually gets an offensive coordinator that, you know, doesn't call it like a stupid ass play. You know what I mean? It'd, he'd be good for him first season. He went to the Pro Bowl in his rookie year. A lot of people doubted him before the draft, and then he had well, a good year. Was he? I think he was, he was voted as an alternate as well. Because well, yeah, he no. was an alternate, but, but he still made he's it. Still into the Pro yeah. Bowl. Which yeah. Can't think of do, we, do we really use Pro Bowls as you know, re- like relevant? No, Phil. Now, but don't be putting it. down your quarterback no, like I'm, that. I'm just saying. No, just all saying. these Patriot fans ever since Tom Brady freaking left your team. They're like, you know, I've seen perfection. He ain't it. Well, you know, he he pretty okay, Phil. He's not like he could be. He could be Zach Wilson over here, right? Throwing three interceptions to the Patriots, and you just know what's going coming. Like it's it's just so hurtful. Right. All right. Yeah. So my answer is Ramondre Stevenson. That's a good pick, Ramondre. He's the best player on that team. Yes. I think offensively. Sorry, he's not better than Judon overall. I guess for what he does to the team, but um, yeah, Ramondre is my answer. And next, we're moving to New Orleans, the Saints. Are we all going to go Kamara? Terrible team. <laughs> sorry, Lawrence. Yeah. I like the Saints. This is, that's Lawrence's I'm not team. sorry. You guys okay. are mid. Oh, Lord. Ooh. That's your coach. The shade. M- 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 oh, mid. Mid. oh you, had, you had that talk about yesterday, too. Uh, had- for for me, uh, an out of the box pick. I think this could be a very, very entertaining cover. He may not be the best player on this team, but uh, uh, let me go with Jamal Williams. Oh, okay. This, this, would, be a, right. this would be a pretty entertaining cover with an anime, an anime cover. I'm just saying, him and Jamal, very entertaining character in, in a, his whole career. You know, why not? Yeah, um, nice me and John are going Kamara, which Kamara. is probably the best answer. Um, I agree with that. It is the best answer. All right, so we're moving on to the New York Giants. This is one of John's favorite teams. I will let you have the floor first, my brother. Uh, I'm going to say, uh, before I make my pick, I enjoyed your uh, analysis on who I think Elijah's going to pick. And because I think he's going to pick that person, I'm going to go with this person. And I'm going to pick Saquon Barkley just because it is a contract year this year. And I think last year he really put him, the Giants on their shoulders. As much as Daniel Jones did, he also put the Giants on his shoulders. Not lying. What but, about the wide receiver? No. I mean, they're they they're the wide receiver stepped up too. Don't be like that. But like, you and, got Slayton, and, yeah. including Kenny Galladay. All right, Kenny Galladay got better at the end of the year. At the end of the year, he did get better. He got like, two touchdowns in a game. In, in one game, he had the same he had the same stat line as Elijah over here. Yeah, well, that was the first the start of the season when he didn't know <laughs> throwback to our real clip. Oh, but uh, yeah, no, I think I think it, it's going to be a, a good year, and I like I'm really excited about the rookies coming in too. So. I'm going to go Saquon. I'll have to go Saquon as well, just so Elijah can get his point off. Yeah, I'm going to go Saquon. All right. So my um, my pick for the cover is actually Saquon Barkley. Fuck you guys. Oh. <laughs> I'm taking Spike? Saquon oh. is really the best, the best player on the team. Player. He said okay. flat twist. He's the best player on the team. He deserves the cover. He said Daniel face Jones. Turn. I love Daniel Jones. Daniel Jones is one of my favorite quarterbacks in the league. He's not one of the best, but he's one of my favorite. Josh Allen Daniel Light. Jones. Um, next we got the Jets, and um, this is mine, mine and John's favorite team. Uh, John, you can have the floor first. Uh, I I think it's a clear. I mean, not maybe it's not a clear. I mean, there are. I I'd also if it if it's not Aaron Rodgers who I'd put on this cover, I'd make it. Uh, every year the Gatorade had weekly rookies of the week, and we had like five or six awards. So I put all those awards with rookie of the year and defense rookie of the year, and I put Bryce. Uh, I want everyone who won an award. I put them in a picture. If it wasn't Aaron Rodgers, yeah, I don't uh, care. Phil, I'm just saying. 
That's what I would uh, do. Give me Sauce Gardner. I mean, he had the, he had the oh, own ass, just Sauce. Okay. He had a weird ass photo shoot with his sauce on his hand, but I feel like they was, they might do something like that just to be corny. So yeah, look at Sauce. I would actually tagging along with John with the rookie thing. I'm putting Sauce and Garrett Wilson on the cover yeah. with their rookie of the year trophies, helmets off, trophies mm-hmm. next to them, and they're sitting on coolers. I, Ooh, I like that cover. a lot. I like that a lot. My fault. I have a vision for every cover. I'm not gonna lie. Right. Um. Next up is the Eagles, and we have to call Brian to make some make some your magic. <laughs> Next up is the Eagles. I'll go first this time. I want to put Jason Kelsey on the cover for real. I'd like say that it'd be hurts and Kelsey. Kelsey. The Kelsey. The Kelsey. Um. The Kelsey brothers cover is actually something I'd like to see now. Now I think about it. Like. That's but, what I think um, they should do with the cover this year. If I had to pick one player, though, I'd put, I put AJ. AJ I do, I do like Jalen Hurts a lot. The Batman I'm, cover? Actually, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not really a Jalen Hurts fan. Wow, really? But he we is. He, I will not. Huh? No, I'm I know. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm being sarcastic. I'm just, oh, okay. I'm not gonna take anything away from him though. Yeah, you don't. Except for everything. Player, no. But I'm just not. I'm just not a fan. For that weak ass throw at, at, at the end of the Super Bowl, though. But yeah, I'm going with AJ for this one. Uh, I mean, Jalen Hurts was an MVP candidate. I'm gonna have to go Jalen. He's he's the most popular player on the team, and they they would go for most popular. So mine mine would be Jason Kelsey snapping the ball to Jalen Hurts looking up. You know what I mean? Just because yeah. I'd have to put them both in it because like Jalen Hurts like talked Jason Kelsey into coming back. Yeah. Like he was gonna retire. Like, oof, that's crazy. Okay, that gives me chills. Go ahead. Pittsburgh is up next. Who yeah. do we have? Let's see. Ooh, I'm gonna get uh, killed for saying this, but Kenny Pickett, why not? Okay, make it a you're make it a killed for saying you're not gonna get killed for saying the quarterback of the team. Should I know, but I just I hate being so that. basic like that. Don't, you know what don't I mean? say like, that. Don't say that around Big Ben though. Big Ben didn't believe in Kenny Pickett at all. I know, but now he does. Yeah. Uh, for me, Dodgy Harris. I mean, Brian Let's back. go pick. Let's go our pick. player. Yeah. Najee Harris' name just crossed my mind, but I would put George Pickens. Ooh, Ooh. okay. And NFL young boy. Another good option, color. TJ TJ Watt too, maybe. Oh yeah, yeah. that's Defensive. a good option as well. Yeah. But I my my pick is definitely going to be George Pickens. Good pick. But Najee Harris is probably the correct answer there. Yeah. Um. Next up, we got San Francisco. This is a lot of options. <laughs> I th- I think Phil was right yesterday with Brock Purdy. I think I said Brock Purdy. Oh, you I said, said Brock Purdy. Purdy. My Let's bad. See. My bad. I'm sorry. You're the one who said Brock Purdy, and it was like, what if we made it a simulation of once you get drafted to seven, Mr. Yeah. Irrelevant? So. Yeah, yeah. That's that was a great better. idea. That was it'd a great be idea. Than, it'd be better than long shot. Yeah. I don't know what else you would put on other than that. You know what I mean? Oh, uh, you would put Debo. I would. I would. I would, I would not say CMC because he just got there. I mean, he's but he played at Stanford mid season. I'm not a I'm not a CMC guy for real. Oh, you're not. Oh, fair enough. Kittle. Oh, I would Kittle actually, could be on the cover. I would go if I had to pick one 49er. I'm picking Brock Purdy. Fair enough. But my backup would definitely be Debo. My pick is CMC. Run CMC cover. Where did Debo go to college? Debo. Yeah. You guys know. Debo. Just off the top of your head, I don't know. Off the top of my head, no. Okay. I just, I just think it's interesting that like Brock Purdy and George Kittle kind of went to like rival colleges. They both came from Iowa. One went to Iowa State. One went to Iowa. USC. Oh, South, really? South really? Carolina, not USC. South Carolina. Oh, okay, South Carolina. Oh, is it, yeah, it is a South Carolina. My fault. I just oh, thought the letters. Good. They're also USC. Yeah, uh, they're the fake uh, USC. Is that same, is that same college that Jadavian Colony went to? Yep. Yes. Ah, so Gamecocks. Yep. Um. Next up after the 49ers, we got the. Uh, Seattle Seahawks and um, John, what you got? We'll go I got DK, yeah, DK Metcalf. I think everybody got DK, yeah. All right, everybody got DK, so we're not even yeah. gonna waste time. We're gonna go to the Bucks, and um, this is tough because they're <laughs> it's disgusting, their quarterback's gone. <laughs> we don't know what the hell to expect from Baker Mayfield, but um, I'm gonna go Mike Evans. I think that's the safest, yeah. I, I, I think it would agree with that, yeah. I'd go Godwin, one of those two, or both of them, Fuck it. both of them would be cool back to back. Like, we're, like all, we're, we're all that's left. That's facts. Um, next up, we got the Titans. And that's easy. Uh, very sad franchise. Derek Henry, though. Yeah. 
The one bright spot. The only, only bright spot that they have left. And um, yep. do last you think Will up, Levitt make makes any like no. like big impact? No, okay. no. Not really. I'm I'm no, I'm I'm glad that they decided that Malik Willis wasn't the answer so fast, so they were uh-huh. able to get somebody else. Yeah. Uh huh. Because after watching Malik Willis, oh my gosh! Please, thank you. That one game against Kansas City, everything else. So. And then the last team in the NFL, which is the Washington Commanders. I wish they were still the Washington football team. Okay, that was a, I like that name a lot. Commanders was a step down, of course. Yeah, Tommy's, but, yeah. You got it. <laughs> hey, Washington. Um, the Washington Commanders. Um, what you guys got? Uh, who plays Chase, Washington? Chase yeah, Young? Chase Young. That's it, right? Um, Chase. I, I mean, you're... Or no, no, no. I got one. I'm sticking with Chase Young. I'm sticking with Chase Young. I would go scary, scary Terry. Terry. It's one of those. Yeah, yeah. I thought that's good. Yeah, trust Smart. Me. Scary Terry. Yeah, scary Terry is probably the answer for that one. And then um. We dropped this already, but I believe everybody's favorite, well, you guys' favorites for the Madden cover this year are, I mean, it's Josh, um, Josh Allen. Yeah. Well, if I, got, I wouldn't win this drops. It, it probably be real by the time this drops, but because they, they're not saying tomorrow, uh, Wednesday, sorry, Wednesday, which is the, to, to, uh, 11 a.m. So it'll basically be tonight. They're doing it 11 a.m. Yep. Oh, this will be out before then. So um, everybody's. Before <laughs> we're doing this before it drops, they got Josh Allen. I have I, Joe I, Burrow, but I would not be surprised if they actually pulled off the Kelsey brothers. I that's what I want. I'm gonna be honest with like, you. That's I, what I, I want. Imagine Josh Allen. Like playing. if they're talking it through with everybody, that's what I want. Like they had their Super Bowl, put them on the damn cover. You know what I mean? I I really do think like if if that's the cover, I'm not mad at that at all. I don't know. I don't even remember when we created. The, why am I throwing my sock around? Yep. I don't know when we created that idea, but um, yeah. June seventh. Not today. June seventh at eleven. All right. Um, I will be trying to tune in. I have a job interview in the morning, but I will try to tune in. But um, yeah. I like the interview. Just. I'd like to yeah. see um. I'd like to see the Kelsey brothers on there, but um. Two people that wouldn't surprise me. I said Joe Burrow is my favorite. Kelsey Brothers wouldn't surprise me. Um, Jay Jettis wouldn't surprise me, and Josh Allen wouldn't surprise me. I feel anybody like else would actually be a surprise. I can't think of anybody else who deservingly should be on the cover. Maybe Aaron. I mean, I, I know this is biased. Aaron Rodgers should not be on the cover. Aaron Rodgers should just not give be on just the give us a Dan Campbell cover, please. A Dan just... Campbell cover would be cool. So think outside the box, though. You know what I mean, like. <laughs> Uh, Some, I mean, I thinking outside the box, like I like that's Hill and Waddle. Yeah, that's, that's a good one. Box. I like that a lot. Um, Garrett Wilson and Sauce Gardner's outside the box is another one yeah. of my favorites. Um, who else did I say that could be on the cover? Hurts? No. Oh, you said Kelsey. The I like Hurts. I don't. But... I don't want to put a solo eagle on there because they just lost the Super Bowl. That really they feels did. weird. They yeah, did. and they'll be um, back. You know what I mean? They're a playoff team. Miles Garrett would not surprise me as well, but I can see I mean, that. Hey, Payton Hills was a weird cover as well. We, 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 we've seen it was a weird cover, cover but at the same yeah. time. But that was like a contest too. Team. Yeah. Like he had to go up against like – he beat some people I, I, that like I, I, were like, Whoa. It was Cam Newton in the finals. Yeah. It was him versus Cam Newton. Yeah. Said, How the hell did Payton Hills beat Cam Newton in the finals? Because – he had a more impo- impactful season in a way, and the fans voted like at least How- Cleveland yeah. versus what are, what are we talking about? Carolina, yeah, did you Carolina know, even fill I out think- a stadium? Like, no, but offense, this is when Cam like was that. just drafted, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, you're right. Okay, never mind. Then. Not yeah. like two or three years in the Cam, yeah. a clear favorite, you know what I mean? But, um, so, hit us with that outro. I was still going through my surprise. Oh, shit, my fault. Yeah, still going yeah. through You know what? It's, it's whatever, bro. Yeah, we moving on. Phil, no, Phil, wants, Phil, Phil wants to end. So, anyways, this has been another episode. Make me look of... like a damn diva. Damn. Well, look like a You are the diva. It's 1120 at, at night. What do you want us to do? I'm trying to help y'all out. We're hey, enjoying man. life. Hey, man. We're, we are okay with being tired. You're the only one here trying to get off of here. You know? Yeah, you know what? But love. <laughs> Me, me, and John could have done this alone without your, you know, your, your negative energy. <laughs> the negative. We didn't need that. The negative energy. Y'all got it. Y'all got it. Go ahead. 
Anyways, yeah, this has been another episode. We with love the you, guys. Too. We just fucking around. Um, we idea. just let us know in the comments what you guys think. Who should be on the cover of this year? <laughs> Not who should be on the cover, but who would you pick by team? You know, just let us know what differences you would have. I don't know, man. I'm just chatting at this point. Um, but you know where to find us: TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch, YouTube, Spotify, Spotify, Visual, Apple Podcasts. You can find us on the Google Podcast too, but nobody watches that shit anyway. But um, you know, Google podcast. Phil said it, not me. Google, if you ever want to hire me, I, I'm. I didn't say it. Okay, Phil said it. Google is. Anyways, a- y'all know where to find us. I hope y'all all have a good night. I'm excited to see who's on this cover. And um, man, just stay tuned. We got some stuff. We got some more stuff coming for y'all. And uh, yeah, man, safety. We out of here. Peace. Catch us next time on Ball Blur Central. <laughs>